Hello there. Welcome back to YouTube. Today I'm going to unbox Honeywell H4W2GR1 IP camera, and we will see how to configure it through web browser. Let's go. This box seal and come from manufacturer. In this, we have CD and user guides. Keep it side for a while. Some screws, nuts, and fissures to fix camera on site. Audio cable and LN key to open camera glass. This is the main camera, fully covered, to prevent from the damages, while shifting. Let's make connections. Take, two patch cards. And, a, PoE switch. Connect one patch card, camera to switch, and, other patch card, from PC to switch. And, insert CD into DVD reader, in your PC. Now let's jump to computer and see how to give IP address to the camera. First of all we need to make our Ethernet adapter as obtain an IP address automatically. To do that, go to Network and Sharing Center by right-clicking on Network Connection Symbol from Taskbar. Then, click on Ethernet. Then, go to Change Adapter Options. Then, right-click on Ethernet. Then, go to Properties. A new pop-up window will open. Select IP version 4. Then, click on Obtain an IP address automatically. Then click on OK. Then, again click on OK. Now close all tabs. Now go to my computer. Then, open DVD reader by dual clicking on it. Here, you will have different folders, like user manual etc. Open Honeywell Configuration Tool folder. Then, extract IPC tool by right clicking on IPC tool zip file. Then, select Extract Files. A new window will open. Select the location where you want to extract this files. Then, click on OK. If you not select any location and click on OK, it will take default location as CD, and this will get error. After extract finished, Open Extracted Folder. Then, open IPC Tool.exe file by dual clicking on Setup. It will start searching automatically for the cameras connected in the same network. You will have list of the cameras which is detected. As you can see on my screen, it detected one camera. To change IP address of that camera, click on the camera. You will see a new screen left side to change IP. Address of the camera. There is two options. If you like to give IP address from DHCP, then click on checkbox, then click on apply. If not, type the IP address, subnet mask, and default gateway in respective columns. Then click on apply. There is a message that the network has been changed. It means our camera IP has been changed from default to new. Then close this tab. Now change the IP address of your PC. To do that, go to Network and Sharing Center by right-clicking on Network Connection Symbol from Taskbar. Then, go to Ethernet. Then, click on Change Adapter Options. A new window will open. Right-click on Ethernet. Then, go to Properties. A new pop-up window will open. Then, go to IP version 4. Another new pop-up window will open. Then, select. Use the following IP address. Then, type IP address and subnet mask in respective columns. Make sure your PC and camera IP address should be in same network. Then, click on OK. Again, click on OK. Now close all tabs. To check camera IP address, changed or not, press Window plus R key from keyboard, then, type ping, space your camera IP address. Then, 
click on OK. A command prompt screen will open, and you able to see that your camera will give reply, as you can see on my screen. It means my camera get new IP address from default. To make camera configure through web browser, open any web browser. Then, type the IP address of the camera. Now click on more information. Then, click on go onto the web page. Type username as admin and password as 1234 default. A new pop up window will open. That is, please change password. Type new password and confirm password. Then, click on OK. To watch live view, we need to download plugins to do it. Click on, click here to download and install the plugin. A new tab will open. Then, click on more information. Then, click on, go on to web page. Click on save. Then, click on run to install plugins. Once installation finished, allow all restrictions. Then, log in with new username and password if changes. As you can see on my screen, live view. To change settings, click on setup. You will have menu to change and Configure all the parameters. Hope you learn how to configure a new camera in easy way. Thank you for watching this video. Like and subscribe to my channel.